So we are at the NVIDIA stand here at Embedded World 2022, and we're talking about a new SBC in the Jetson line. So you may have heard of the Jetson Nano and the Jetson Xavier. This is the Jetson Orin. Uh, AGX Orin, is that right? Yes, it is, it is correct. Um, and so would you like to give a quick introduction to yeah. uh, the board? So this is the, uh, as you mentioned, this is the latest version of NVIDIA Jetson product line. Uh, it, it, we are calling it Jetson AGX Orin, and it also has another form factor uh, in name of NX Orin. So it is now released as a developer kit, mm -hmm. and right now it will be available as a module too. Mm -hmm. So uh, basically, the latest version before this uh, had 500 cores in it, mm -hmm. CUDA cores, but right now this device has 200, uh, 2,000 of uh, CUDA cores. Mm -hmm. So it is close to a performance of a laptop. Yeah. It's, eight, it's eight times as faster than the latest generation. So, and it brings uh, multiple camera deployments or multiple model deployments on each device, uh, like this demo here. So, so just, uh, just quickly, I know we're, we're getting video of it right now, um, uh, but I want to point out that this massive 4K display is being yeah. driven in 4K from this small single board computer down here. Um, would you like to explain exactly, you said there's multiple uh, kinds of um, inference going on in parallel yeah. on the device. Do you want to explain what each one of those is and what's happening right now? Yeah, of course. So what, what we are uh, doing right now in this demo exactly is uh, we are running an object detector uh, in the first phase and then we assign a tracking ID for each of the detections mm -hmm. with a tracker. Uh, and then we are assigning uh, a couple of classification models in parallel yeah. uh, in terms of uh, classifi classifying genders, mm -hmm. emotions, and age range, mm -hmm. I can say. So there are five elements here mm -hmm. running in pipeline uh, in parallel. Yeah. And running quite quickly. I'm, I'm assuming that in the top left corner there is the FPS, right? Yes, exactly. And so I'm seeing it running anywhere between 20 and 50 FPS, depending on how many things are on the screen at once, which is kind of kind of amazing, actually. Yeah, exactly. So mm -hmm. it, we could actually uh, squeeze it a little bit harder uh, for in terms of uh, optimization to mm -hmm. get maximum of it. So uh, when it comes to capabilities, it can run at 30, at least 30 streams at 1080p at mm -hmm. 30 FPS. Yeah. Uh, with the inference results. Okay. Wow. But yeah. yeah. But now uh, we are bringing just one USB or GMSL camera here. Yeah. Uh, so once the detections go up, mm -hmm. uh, yes, it ca it can uh, the performance can make some drops. Mm -hmm. But as you said, we can get real time results uh, in parallel with the models. You know. That's fantastic. And um, one of the things you mentioned before as well is that you have the, the single board computer itself, yeah. but there's a range of baseboards for it for different tasks. Yes, um, is exactly. there anything specific about those that you'd want to talk about? Uh, uh, when it comes to uh, this side of the things, uh, the Jetson modules can be used with uh, carrier boards. Uh -huh. It's like, you know, the carrier boards equals uh, the main boards yeah. from the PC world. So, uh, it changes or it varies uh, in terms of the ports, interfaces, uh, like network usages or USB usages or display output usages. Yeah. So uh, you could just go ahead and you know choose whichever you need yeah. for the, each Jetson device. Precisely, yeah. And, uh, and, 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 and so in theory, looking at the one here, um, we have uh, several uh, d d networking ports, yes. but only one HDMI port. Yeah. However, if what was more important was uh, a single network port with multiple monitors or whatever, exactly. you could actually use one with more HDMI outputs exactly. and the single board computer would support yeah. that. Yeah. yeah, exactly. So uh, in terms of that one, uh, you could also plug it in uh, multiple uh, IP cameras yeah. into this one. It's like, it will, like, you know, it will be like a, a mini switch, mm -hmm. you know. You can just uh, easily synchronize between your IP cameras and bring out uh, multiple camera deployments demos at Fantastic, the same time, yeah. yes. And this is, uh, so yeah, as mentioned at the start of this uh, interview, this is the newest board in the Jetson uh, Nano, in the Jetson line, sorry, not the Jetson Nano line. Yeah. Um, so the, uh, the Jetson Orin is something that's available to buy now, yeah? Yes, exactly. In terms of the developer kits, it's available. Yeah. Uh, it can be, you know, uh, reclaimed, I can say, yeah. from the stores uh, around the world. and. The module part is not released yet, I think, uh, but it will be released in uh, coming months. Mm -hmm. And after that, you can go ahead and buy uh, the carrier boards for your needs. Cool. All right, well, thank you. Thanks so much thank for speaking you. to me today. Cheers. Take care. Cheers.